I am the creator of my life. It all starts from within. I love myself unconditionally. I forgive myself quickly. I am compassionate with myself. I am my biggest fan. All that I do, all that I see, is all a perception of where I am in life right now. If I do not agree with my perception, I must do the inner work. I am beautiful. I am strong. I am love. I am a money magnet. I am compassionate. I am forgiving. Thank you, God, for this day. Thank you for all of the prosperity and abundance that I already have and all that is on the way. Thank you, God, for always loving me and assisting me, guiding me, and showing me what unconditional love for myself should be. I am that I am that I am. And so it is. Namaste royalties. I just wanted you to come in with me as I begin um, really getting moving on this day. Uh, it is my day four on the elimination diet and I am so glad I did not give up <laughs> yesterday or the day before. This is the first day that I have woke up and not been bloated or felt like I had to run to the bathroom. So if this is the beginning of what feeling good feels like, oh baby, I'm all for it. <laughs> So, um, like I said, this is my day four, and I feel better. You know, sometimes we just have to get through the uncomfortable times, the uncomfortable moments, and realize that they're just moments. They are just moments. And you are allowed to feel everything you feel in that moment royalty. Yes, you are. And I'm so happy I recorded it that I can look back and say that was not a good moment, but you persevered. So um, I have not uh, broke my fast yet. It's only um, like noon, a little afternoon um, I've kind of just been still this morning, um, in and out of just quiet time, meditation, just gratefulness, um, just a little self-care, you know, I showed a little love to the locks, um, um, you know, just enjoying me. So... We're going to go ahead and get this day started and uh, we'll be back with what I break my fast with on this low fat map, no gluten, herbal holistic journey that I am on and um, I do have my tea though. Yeah. I don't go too far in the day without a good cup of tea and that is matcha tea. Um, um, and the one that I'm taking, I think it only has like five calories. So I don't consider that breaking my fast. So, you know, that's for me. But yeah, 
I'll be back <laughs> with breakfast. So this was the first meal I attempted, guys. I had my chicken tenders from the previous night that were seasoned up with the seasons I can have. And some quinoa with some low fat salsa on it. It was a no-go for me. I took about two bites of the quinoa. I couldn't do it. The chicken tenders were still good. I ate one of those. And then I just drank down some water because, uh, no. Nah. I, I just was not feeling it. I missed the seasoning on the quinoa that I usually put on. So that first meal that you saw, God, that was around 2 o'clock. Um, I drank down some water, went and picked up the kids, came back home, and I felt a little hungry. So I was like, let me try to eat again. Um, it was about 4.45, going close to 5. I took the chicken tenders, put them on some gluten-free bread with a little low-fat my barbecue sauce, low-fat my chips, and some kiwi. Well, the bread is very thick. It is okay. I can do it. I have to get used to it. I do want to try some other brands of bread, though. Um, the chips were pretty good, too. Uh, I did not do the kiwi. I took one bite, and it just was not happening. Um, I did eat the sandwich and the chips. So, yeah, that was lunch. Well, guys, this is the last meal of the day, and I did do some of the uh, Miracle Pasta. I believe it was a spinach flavored. I threw in some carrots and some shrimp and some uh, soy sauce, a little bit of soy sauce. The seasonings that I can have, some lemon juice, um, Tabasco sauce. I, I did the best I could to flavor this bad boy up. It was okay. Shrimp was great, but the new. I do not think that I will be getting this flavor of noodles again. It was a little too hard to um, get the taste of what I'm even used to, but it was palatable. <laughs> um, I think the shrimp really helped in the Tabasco sauce because I do like heat with my food. Um, I have to work on the seasoning, so I'm thinking about ordering some low fat mop seasoning. So I'm looking at some of these type of seasonings here because I'm finding that um, in the beginning stages, at least for me, it's easier to go with foods that have already been clarified to be low fat map, gluten free and all those type of things. And then eventually as I get used to this, you know, I can come up with my own seasoning style, but it's tough. It's really tough with this. All right, guys, that sums up my day four. Um, it is going a little bit better than, than I thought it would. So I'm pretty happy about that. I'm still kind of struggling with my food choices. Um, not even the food choices. Let me say the seasoning choices. So I'm going to really take a look into that um, because I do want this journey to get easier and I want to be able to enjoy myself and enjoy the food that I do eat during the day. So yeah, hope you enjoyed day four. Thank you for following on this journey. Um, please make sure that you subscribe and hit the bell below because like I said, I will be uh, sharing the complete journey with you guys. Um, if you have any questions that I can't answer, I will be more than happy to. Um, and yeah, I'll see you tomorrow.